Hey everybody, Yuri Matsuo here, and today we're going to look at how to update the Honda's navigation from the Garmin website. So, let's walk you through every step. Alrighty, first things first, you need a 16 gigabyte minimum USB and you have to insert that into your center console. You then are going to press on the menu tab and scroll down and go to settings. After that, you're going to scroll down again and go to device and then you're going to go to update map. So it's going to tell you that you need to go to garmin.com forward slash Honda to update your navigation system and then it's going to upload a code onto your USB drive. Now it's important that you get this message here that says it's been written to your external media. If you didn't receive this, then it didn't work correctly. You turn off your vehicle and take your USB. After you've plugged in your USB, go to the Garmin website, go to automotive, and then map updates. Now in the middle of the page, you're going to see it says download Garmin Express. So you're going to go ahead and click on that and then you're going to download either to a Mac or to Windows. After it's been downloaded, go ahead and install the Garmin Express following all the regular installation procedures. After it's been installed, go ahead and open up Garmin Express. Next, go ahead and click the Get Started button and add a device. And then the computer is going to go ahead and search the USB for that code that the Honda installed on that USB. Now at this point, it's going to ask you if you want to register your vehicle. You don't have to do this part, so you can do it if you want. Then it's going to go ahead and ask you if you want to add a nickname to the vehicle, so you can do that if you choose. Next, it's going to go ahead and search for an update, which can take up to four hours, so make sure that you have power and a good internet connection. Four hours later, it should be installed, and now we can go ahead and remove the USB and go back to the truck to continue with this update. Now we can click the menu item again, scroll down to settings, click on settings again, and then we're going to scroll down again. We're going to go back to the device information, and we're going to update the map. Now this can take up to an hour, but it took me about 20 minutes, so you can probably sit there, play a video game or something, watch a movie, but eventually it will be successful, you're going to press OK, and that's the end of the update. So make sure that you guys are subscribed to the channel to be updated on all the latest video releases, and thank you for watching.